Assalamu alaikum guys, today's video is very important, it's going to be short but it's going to change your life. So really pay attention and listen to me, okay? So in life we all have problems, you have problems, I have problems, we all have problems, we all have our own tests and trials and we want solutions to these problems. And a lot of the time we're just blaming Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, you know, it's destiny. But Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has clearly mentioned the Quran that, you know, Many of these problems that come in our way, you know, they are the results of our hands. We are the creators of these problems. And it's our mindset which created the problems. And the mindset that creates the problems, how can that same mindset find solutions for those problems? So if we want to find solutions to our problems, we have to change our mindset. And this month, Ramadan, it's that catalyst that's going to speed up the entire process of changing your mindset, changing your character and changing your life. How? Now listen to me, okay? So in the Quran, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he tells us, he says, fast, fasting, inshallah, it's going to lead you to, um, to taqwa. Okay, by the way, I'm paraphrasing all the Quranic ayat. Okay, I'm not really translating them word to word. Okay, and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, he also says in another ayah, he says, worship your Lord, it's going to lead to taqwa. So one thing it's very clear is that worship leads to taqwa. And we all know taqwa means to be God conscious, to always think about him. So just tell me something. When you're always thinking about Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, what are you trying to do? You are trying to change your mindset. So Ramadan, it's the month which changes our mindset. So worship leads to taqwa and taqwa is a change of mindset. And in the Quran, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has mentioned many qualities which are the result of taqwa, which are the result of this changed mindset. From those qualities, he mentioned sincerity, truthfulness, justice, charity, lots of other qualities. What are these qualities? They are a change of character. So change of mindset leads to change of character. Now tell me, if your mindset has changed, your character has changed, are your problems going to be the same? No. Now you will start to look for solutions to those problems. Because remember, your mind created the problems. The same mind cannot be used for solutions. You have to change that. You have to change the character. You have to change the emotions to find solutions. So let me just give you an example. So um, let's just say, for example, you know, you have a bad relationship with someone because something happened in the past. And that thing that happened in the past, every time you see the person, same thoughts are coming to your mind, same thoughts. The thoughts are never changing. Years and years have passed by, but your thoughts never change. And every time you think the same thing, your same old emotions keep on coming. Same thoughts, same emotions. How can you change your relationship with this person when your thoughts and your emotions are the same every time you see them? If you want to change your relationship with this person, you'll have to change the thoughts. You'll have to change the emotions. And that's what taqwa does. That's what this change mindset does. So, you know, this month, it's really the month which really helps us to change our mindset. Because out of Ramadan, you can keep on trying, but it's so hard because you're doing this on your own. In the month of Ramadan, the entire Muslim community is together. You know, we increase so much in our ibadat, taraweeh. We don't pray out of Ramadan. We pray this in Ramadan. It's not done out of Ramadan. It's done in Ramadan. The Hajjud, we all pray so much more regularly in Ramadan, you know, in Ramadan, we're trying to either recite the whole Quran or we are just studying so much more tafsir. We're trying, we're trying our best to understand the Quran so much. So our ibadat are really increasing so much in Ramadan because we're all together in this. And when we're all together in this, it, it just really helps to change our mindset because, you know, the shaitan is locked. We're controlling our nafs. We're trying not to sin. And all of that really helps to change our mindset. And when the mindset changes, you know, to, our character changes. And again, we are together in this as a community changing our character becoming better people and all of that it really speeds up out of Ramadan you're going to be on your own try to do that this Ramadan this Ramadan focus on your taqwa focus on changing your mindset focus on changing your character and I'm telling you your lives will change all of those problems that you created you'll start to look for solutions for all of those problems use this Ramadan to change your life take care assalamu alaikum